Me and my violin. When I was three years old, an ordinary evening turned into something special. Grandma Peg brought her violin to my house and let me hold it, play notes on it, and move the bow. After that night, I begged my parents to take violin lessons. Soon my wish came true. My parents found a teacher and a tiny violin for me to play. Up like a rocket, down like the rain. When I first began, I couldn't play songs right away. I didn't even get to hold the violin. The first thing I learned was how to hold my bow. We played games until my hand muscles grew stronger. Finally, I got to learn my first song after months of practice. I had mastered Twinkle Twinkle Little Star and many other songs as well. I finished my first lesson book and received a certificate at my recital. I felt so proud. I learned that little by little, even something that seems impossible can be accomplished. I have been playing the violin for about five years, and all of the things that used to be difficult for me are easy now. I feel like I've been doing them my whole life. I feel proud and happy when I perform for other people. My teacher, Mrs. Bentz, makes playing lots of fun. She teaches me to do my best and encourages me if I'm frustrated. Once, when I was having a bad week, she told me to find a new place to practice every day. That week was lots of fun. I got to play in the bathtub, my treehouse, and even while doing the splits. I don't always feel like practicing. My days are busy, and sometimes I wish that I could just relax at night instead of practicing. Once I get started, though, I usually have fun, and sometimes Mom has to tell me to stop playing and go to bed. I don't know for sure yet what I want to be when I grow up, but I know that I'll always be a violinist. Playing the violin makes me happy.